Good afternoon, I'm Anna Dusser. And I'm Cron Adams. Welcome to Echo News. With Hanukkah ending last night, let's go to Evelyn to see how students celebrated. So how I celebrate Hanukkah is by lighting one candle each night uh, and saying a prayer over them. And then I eat dinner with my family. And one of my favorite parts about Hanukkah is kind of, again, being together with my family. It's really about being with who you are, and I guess one of my favorite parts is kind of eating latkes. Okay. Um, well, I celebrate Hanukkah with my family, and my dad comes over to my mom's house, and we make a, bu a bunch of food. We have latkes, and um, we have a lot of cookies, Hanukkah cookies that we decorate. We light the menorah when it's like 8 o'clock, something in the evening. And we just sing a lot of Hanukkah songs and have presents. And my favorite part about Hanukkah is probably lighting the menorah because we're all together and we're just singing all together. Thank you, Evelyn. Now go to Natalia for a preview of this Friday's hockey game against Benil. All right, I'm Natalia Caraballo and I'm with Luke Mobley. And um, how is the team preparing for the game on Friday? So we've got, we got a game tonight, and then... A little over 10 minutes, uh, Kevin. It has been an end-to-end. -end. Both teams have had opportunities, and uh, exactly what we expected. A very good... Uh, was it Tuesday today? So Wednesday, Thursday, we got practice. Uh, the day before the game, we kind of go over what we're going to... Kind of the game plan. So, yeah, we kind of got the week to, to prepare, so it should be good. Are you guys doing anything different to prepare against the NIL? Um, Their team is a pretty... They uh, they don't have any superstars, but they're they're a good team. So we just kind of like every game we come we come prepared and we play our game. And uh, we're a good team. They're a good team. So it should be a good game. So yeah, probably nothing different. All right. Um, and how are you looking to improve from last last year's game against Benel? Yeah, we split with them. We won one and they won one. So probably won both of them this year. Thank you, Natalia. Next, we'll go to Creston to hear about a student making waves in St. Louis Park's rap scene. Sophomore Nebu Bekele currently has 13 posts displaying different songs he has written throughout this past year. Okay, so how did you get into rap? Well, like, just, I loved music growing up even as a child. Like, my life has been around music. And, like, in middle school, like, I just, like, started writing songs and stuff. And, like, and like when I like in my freshman year, I like started messing around with beats and like record recording songs and yeah. Okay. The other day he released his newest single, Everybody, on SoundCloud, adding to his collection of two other SoundCloud singles. So why, wh what do you rap about? Well, for me, I, I rap about like a lot of like variety things. Uh, just like real life issues, real life situations about like in life. Uh, some, I use music as fun as therapy for people. Like, my other, I make music so like other people can relate to it and other people can enjoy it at the same time, but can use it as therapy. I'm According to Bekele, he currently has 294 followers on Instagram and hopes to keep publicizing his music so more people follow. Thank you for watching. We'll see you after the holidays. Anna Jusser. Kron Adams, signing off.